I'll let you do the controlling because you know what you're doing. And you do the looking around. I'll be the eyes and you can do the controlling. Am I looking at the telly? It's a full 360 thing, so you can look in there. Ah, that's right. And Oh, sorry. It's creepy the way it disappears. Oh, you can see it. Oh, you can see it slowly. Oh, you see it slowly. Oh, Connor, this is weird. Oh, my God, I'm freaking out. God, this is really weird. All right, I've reached the seabed. Can't see much. We're still a couple of hundred meters out. And oh, wow. Control. Shall we run an equipment test? Sure, let's do this by the book. All right, let's run through the submersible. Oh, this is really weird. Controller. If you hold down the circle button, a control diagram will appear in front of you. You can operate the submersible using these controls on your controller. Okay. You can move the submersible forward, back, left, and right using the left stick. To make the submersible ascend and descend, push up or down on the right stick. The right stick also controls the sub's rotation left and right. Great. How do I interact with objects? You can interact with objects in the submersible by holding down the L2 button and then looking around with your right stick. When you look at an object you can interact with, a green circle will appear. Then just press the cross button. Ah, oh, just stay s sitting down because I'm safe for that way. Again to up the controls diagram. Right. Now we'll move on to the uh, I'm not very well balanced when I'm standing up. In front of you is a map. It shows your current location as a blue pointer at the bottom of the screen. As you approach the wreck, it will slowly appear on the map. The yellow icon is your current goal location, so you know where you should be heading. Update uh, the map and your goal locations as we go through contracts. Right. Oh, this is really... The screen just to the left of the console displays the mission log. It shows your current goal task. So if you aren't sure what you should be doing or looking Connor, for... Connor, this is really weird. ...for more information. Okay, you'd better place a marker before we head too far. Interact with the button next to the map to place one. Interact with the button in front of the map to place a marker. Marker's been placed. You can head to Sorry. The <laughs> so, I had a call oh, I'm moving. Oh, cool. Problem? 
No, all fine. Just voicing her excitement about us finally diving. Said she's looking forward to seeing what we can do. I've set up a call for 8 p.m. this evening. For $45,000 a day? Let's just hope we find something. Never mind the money. My doctorate is riding on this. Oh, this is really freaky. I'm starting to poop myself. Right, I should get my lights ready now that I'm getting close to the bow. You can control the movement of the sub's lights by using the up, down, left, and right buttons on your controller. To turn the spotlights on and off, interact with the button in front of the lever. Oh, this is really weird, Connor. I don't know whether I like it. Whoa. There's something you don't see every day. She's a beauty. There you go. I should jump right ahead. Oh, my good grief. Okay, first things first. We've got oh, I'm freaking out, Connor. I'm freaking out. ...to place their commemorative plaque on the forecastle deck. Get yourself into position. All right. Oh, it is really weird. That brilliant experience, love. This, this is the, um, bow. So I'll tell you what to do. Coming up to it now. You'll need the Predator for this task. Ah, the ROV. Yep. Courtesy of Flight Avionics and the latest in augmented reality technology. If you look up... You'll find a set of VR goggles and a control panel. To deploy the ROV, hold down the L2 button and look at the VR goggles. The controls to maneuver the Predator are the same as the submersible. Oh, I don't like it, Connor. Make your way over <laughs> to the plaques already Do you want to have a go? on the deck. And remember that the range oh, is only up is to really 15 weird. meters. The advantage of driving without an umbilical. Is there any way to boost the signal? I'm going to close my eyes. <laughs> yeah, but we need to upgrade the deep sea transmitter and they don't come cheap. The generosity of our sponsors and UNS funding only goes so far. If we complete these contract jobs, we might just be able to afford some upgrades. What happens if I go out of range? The automatic recall kicks in. ROV comes straight back to the sub. Oh my... I'm here. Great. The plaque we're placing is in the Predator's inventory. You can remember the oh. menu. I'll take a photograph with the onboard camera for the society. Great idea. They'll appreciate it. Press the cross button to take a photograph. You can get out of camera mode by pressing and releasing. No need. Just press the triangle button on your controller. Now you're back in the sub. Recall the ROV. Oh, that was weird. It's a buggy on the right. Where to now? Hull breach on E deck. I'll mark it on the map. We're heading for his cabin, right? That's right. Eyewitness testimony said Henderson kept a journal. It should tell us more about his activities on the final night. I presume I'm looking for some kind of trunk. Oh, Connor, it's really weird. I love it. It's freaky at first. Oh, it's brilliant. You are. You've been a big help. Oh, look at the detail. Sorry, I'm freaking out. That's all right. We're going to go inside. Freak We're actually going to go inside of it. I'm going to give you the heads up now. Oh, good. I better just close. I'm eating inside one of the Oh, what was it like for you when you first started playing this game? Were you. You all get used to it, honestly. Look at the size of it. That orange thing, that's where we've got to go. It's tough. Dr. Lynch. Ah. Uh, yeah. Why are we doing this? Forty-five thousand dollars a day at sea. No, I know, but that just about covers the costs of the expedition. I meant, like, why are we oh, taking okay. this job in particular? Well, oh, look at the why do you think controllers she hired us? moving. Because we're academics. Yes, but more specifically, we respect the history. It would have been cheaper for our sponsor to just hire a salvage team. Uh, why do you agree to take it? Funding like this comes once in a blue moon. 
And I wanted to see her up close. Connor, it's massive. Oh my This breach is from the impact with the ocean floor. Anything in here is going to be messy. I'll keep my eyes peeled. It's towards the top of the breach. Look for the flashing beacon. I really hope this breach is there. Look up there. Ah, I found a briefcase. I just need to pick it up by pressing the cross button to interact. Oh, this is weird. WJH. I think this is it. Well, that's lucky. Are you going to open it? No. Oh, Connor, this is strange. Oh, my good grief. I'll have to bring it back to the lab before we can take Oh, this is weird. Okay, you should put the briefcase in the Predator's storage then. Let's get you to the surface. Activate the autopilot and get comfortable. Ah, sorry. Oh, Connor, look. Oh, this is amazing. Oh, the detail on it. I had my eyes closed at one point, but I thought, no, I'm going to try and be brave. Dad, this is brilliant. You've got to try it. Dad. Right. Do you know where the sugar is? Do you know where the sugar is? Oh, I didn't think no sugar off. Just use sweetener. You don't need a lot though, because it makes it taste funny if you put too much in. Dad, I wish you could see this. This is really good. You gotta try it when you've got time. Ah, uh, Ob, still, I'm waiting for you. I don't like touching anything because I don't know what I'm doing. Are you there, Conk?
Okay. Yeah. From the scale of one to a hundred, have I officially cured your fear of big ships and rats? A hundred. Dad, mm. oh, you got to try this later. It's really good. It's freaky at first, but once you get used to it, it's all right. Okay. Thank you for letting me go on it. Okay. Connor, this is amazing. Look to the autopilot, mate. Alright, I'll see you in about two hours. Oh, this is brilliant. It was a bit scary at first, but. Officially cured your fear of ships. Yep. Oh, this is amazing. Thank you for letting me go on it. Oh, wow. Oh, there's a woman here. Whoa, looks to be in good condition. But this journal is pretty special. The pages seem to be a fabric paper blend. I think the desalination bath will leach out the salt. Then it can go into the PEG station before freeze drying. The silver doesn't look great after being in the ocean. This tobacco tin is covered in silver sulfide. I'll have to gently wash this using a soft brush. These banknotes are delicate and we'll need a good rinsing in the desalination bath. Then we can treat them in the fungicide to keep them clean. A bone hair comb. I'll need to wash the salt out quickly before Ow. it crystallizes Sorry, and Coco. the bone starts to crumble. It's ready for drying in the acetone bath. Yeah.
Why the stool? Wow. Wow. It's come up great. Ah, oh, that one. Not that thing we were just looking at. Get that. Ah, I'm looking at it. Oops. I'm leading fives. If you want to get up and do it, that's cool. We'll flip. Do what you just did. Do what. Now look at the door opens it. Yeah, that's 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 it. Yeah, that's
Hmm. Looks like a receipt for a telegraph sent on the night of April 14th. That's strange. I haven't found any reference to one being sent. I wonder what it said. We can Please check with our sponsor Spencer. when she we calls. We can tell her the news. We could also search the first class purser's office tomorrow. Boat. See if we can Hi, find Jamie. the record book. We're doing great. Passenger's place. We've just finished cleaning the artifacts we found today. We managed to access Henderson's cabin and retrieve his briefcase. Wonderful. Inside we found his journal, a few personal items still in good condition. One interesting item is a receipt for a telegraph sent on the night of the sinking. Oh, that is interesting. I didn't know William sent a message. That's what we thought. It's possible it wasn't sent, and that it's still in either the purser's office or the Marconi room. We're thinking our next dive should be to explore these rooms. I know teams have searched the Marconi room before, but I didn't think the purser's office was accessible. Yeah, up till now it's been off limits due to the size of ROVs, but ours is small enough to access it. We're hoping what you, you might find the purser's record book, with the message listed. Uh, As for the Marconi room, other dives have shown most of the furniture has deteriorated, but the telegraph canisters might have survived. Sounds plausible. Let me know if you find anything. I'd love to see the message he sent. I've only the letters from Southampton. I noticed something odd in his journal. On the 14th he mentions carrying some special package. But I'm sure he didn't have anything reported in the manifest. Do you have any idea what it could be? Well, in his last letter, he wrote about returning home with a present for my great-grandmother. I'll do a bit of research on my end. I can check over the manifest again to see if we missed anything. Great. We'll let you know if we find anything tomorrow. I'm sending over photos of the items we found today. Thanks, I really appreciate the regular updates. It's making writing much easier. We'll talk again soon. Well, shall we call it a day? Not quite. Jillian was kind enough to order in a stronger transmitter for our ROV. We'll need to fit it before the dive tomorrow. Otherwise, we won't be able to reach the purser's office. <sighs> I'll get on it now, then. It's waiting for you over there. Thanks. I need to replace the transmitter in the ROV with the one on the table next to it. The instructions for replacement are on the posters behind the ROV rack, and I can access the lower sections of the ROV by lifting the rack bar up. I need to replace the transmitter in the ROV with the one on the table next to it. I need to lift the black hood to place the transmitter, then lift the bar up to put the sample container in the storage compartment. Hand. Oh. Sorry. She's all ready to go for tomorrow. Cool. I'll see you in the morning then. Well, that was weird. I couldn't.